Hi, welcome, and I hope you're doing well. In this video here, I'll be doing screen replacement, and I'll walk you through step by step on how to do that. Here, I have the HP Chromebook X360, and this is the model 14A. This is the front, and um, I'd like to show you the screen. As you can see, that the LCD screen is pretty cracked. So what I'll do is I need a screen replacement and what I have tested earlier before I do the screen replacement just to make sure that everything works is I get one of these USB-C to a VGA connector. So I connect the computer here on the USB-C and output it to my monitor, the external monitor. And I was able to see the screen and able to log in and see my data so in other words I know that the computer works it's just that the LCD screen is bad so I'll be going do a replacement on this let me show you how to do the screen replacement so this is the bezel and the bezel does not have any screw attached to it in other words that the bezel is actually double-sided adhesive tape that glues onto it so let's go ahead and remove the bezel I'm using a metal prying tool to stuck underneath that double-sided tape. As you're removing the bezel, you can feel like the tape is coming out along with uh, by pulling it apart. So it's okay, take your time, no rush on that part. Okay, when it comes to the very bottom here, I like you to pay more attention to it because I do not want you to break uh, the cable so we just do it slowly okay so here comes the entire bezel you come open up and the next step I'd like you to do is to take a look at the uh, the screen so this screen right here is double sided tape that tape onto it you see this little black tape? We need to remove the black, black tape. There's no screw holds onto the screen. It's actually uh, taped onto the screen. So let's go ahead and remove this tape by pulling the tape out. Okay, so this is the sticky double-sided tape. He has it on both sides, one on the left and one on the right. So let's get the left one out here. Okay, once you have the two tips removed, the screen should just come right off without any problem. Now you're going to flip the screen towards your body. And at this point here, this is the connector. Make sure the connector is... Make sure you remove, not to remove, like, you know, peel that tape here. And there is a little clipper. This clipper here is to secure the LCD screen. Uh, to, to secure the connector. So once you have the clipper open, you can slide the connector away from your body and that's how you remove it. Now once you do that, the entire screen will just come straight up. Now this is the replacement part, NT140WHM-T00. I will have the screen replacement link in the description below. You can click on the uh, description and check out the link. It will direct you to either Amazon or eBay uh, for the purchase on the screen replacement. All right, so once you have the new screen, you just have to do the reverse process. Uh, install the clipper first and connect the connector. The next part is you need to buy, um, you need to buy this red adhesive double-sided tape. So this tape here is to retape the LCD screen, the new LCD screen, right? So you need to have this tape, tape it down on the metal side, okay? And this example, okay? I do not have the new screen with me yet. I'm just going to give you an example. So tape it down from top to bottom, right? Tape it down, cut it, and then... And then what you want to do is you want to leave an extra room right about this much 
So this is your bottom part of the screen. Leave about this much so that when you flip it on the other side, you can see that this extra piece is sticking out here. So the next time if you want to do a replacement, you know where the tape is aligned with. Okay, it's aligned with the screen. So you know what to do to pull it for the next time. So leave it a little bit slightly extra room for you, for yourself. And then what you want to do is you want to go ahead and you know peel the uh, the plastic off. And there you have it. So this is your double sided tape and you can just tape it onto the the screen. All right, so I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, hope that this video helps you to do your own replacement. Uh, if you have any question, just comment below. I look forward to answer those questions and um, please click the like and subscribe if this video helps you in your screen replacement. Thank you and I'd like to hear from you. Take care now. Bye-bye.